there's another clip on the Tasha K show mm-hmm. where they are demanding that Gigi prove that legacy is your brother's daughter. But she produced, Gigi produced documents from the hospital that they did in vitro, mm-hmm. which means that the the ch- legacy was conceived not through sexual intercourse but mm-hmm. through a medical procedure that only your brother could have provided mm-hmm. um the semen mm-hmm. to to create legacy mm-hmm. why in the heck is sharice mills and your brother now saying oh we need to do a dna test to make sure that legacy is really really the daughter of of termaine is it your daughter do you have a daughter with her i asked her to alleged a fratern- uh, paternity test for a whole year. Okay. Okay, so l- let me break it down. Um, go in depth with it, right? Before we get into the shiny. Yeah, of course. Oh, the my. shiny wine. Listen. So, shiny O'Neill. Okay, so listen. So basically, <laughs> okay. it, it's like this. So I, I met her. Mm-hmm. Uh, we've, it was like, you know, having fun moments, right? Mm-hmm. Then I sent her back to the streets. Once I sent her back to the streets, she came back pregnant. When she came back pregnant, uh, she was like, oh, um, I'm three months pregnant. So when uh, when she ended up delivering the baby, she was like, oh, I'm delivering the baby at six months because she has seizures and stuff, right? So I'm like, okay, cool. So we go to the first week um, doctor's appointment, right? Doctor was like, yeah, you, you went over, you was 41 weeks. I'm like, bitch, you 41 weeks? You told me it was, you had the baby early. So the math wasn't adding up. And I'm like, bitch, you was big as fuck to be only um, six months. And then she was like, no, I just blow up big and stuff like that. Then I started finding out she was at the crazy house and all this stuff. Uh, and I gave her a life that she wanted. But... So you took care of her and the baby? Yes, at first. While she was pregnant. While at she was first. Okay. While he she was, was he pregnant. He thought it was his. But I wasn't with her. I was uh, with Black China. At the time she was pregnant. Oh. He just did things to keep her at ease while she was pregnant. Because I was living with Black China and she was staying at my house. So I let her stay at my house because she was pregnant. And she was pregnant supposedly with my child. But I've been asking her like every single for every other day, then it went uh, once a week, then twice a week, and then it's no results. She don't want to get a, a paternity test. We she did. I don't get that. I mean, Cerise was wasn't around. Like I said, she wasn't in the picture. I know for a fact because I was gonna do in vitro with uh, my ex. You know, at the time, we was gonna have kids at the same time. I want. Uh, she wanted a boy. And they just wanted a, they wanted a a, a girl because he had all boys, and then I had uh, my my ex had all girls, so we was gonna do it all at the same time. But we decided not to do it. Uh, we ended up getting pregnant and having twin girls, you know. So we decided not to uh, not to do it. But at, we was going to both do the procedure at the same time. So, so you're talking about you and your your girl was gonna have a child at the same time that Gigi and Termaine was having legacy. Mm-hmm. Okay, so you you believe legacy is your is your niece 100 percent right? 100 <laughs> percent. I'm not gonna never deny my blood for nothing. Like that's my blood. She got my blood running through her veins. That's my niece. I mean, do you ever t- call your brother and say, hey? This is you're you're crossing the lines when you you're, when you're going to this area about family and um, DNA and I don't know if it's mine. Have you ever had that conversation with them? It's it's I don't really need to have that conversation with him because it's so far fetched. He's been saying outlandish shit for a while. So at the end of the day, me saying it now is it's not doing nothing. Like like I said, they have both of them. They have a mental illness and people need to be aware. You know, mental illness is uh, uh, very serious, and you, people need to take that very serious. It don't matter what they look like. It don't matter how they, you know, put on a, a smile, fake smile. Because if you go into bed with somebody, knowing goodness well, y'all just hop, hopped on a plane, got on a podcast, and y'all both just blatantly just lying 
and then y'all go sleep with each other. How could you sleep with somebody that's like, damn, we just sat up here and just like, there's no integrity for nothing that they've been doing. Like that shit, <laughs> that shit is crazy. And, and what's the name of your brother's brand? It, it, yeah, it's IBM. That shit, you can't. What is it? Integrity before before, before money, right? Yeah, before money. Integrity yeah. before money. Mm-hmm. Which he can't even copyright IBM. That shit is already being copyrighted. So from IBM, what, what was that? IBM computers back in the day. International business machines. Yeah. So that shit is just stupid for you. <laughs> it's a lot of copyright infringement going around this motherfucker. 